I'm Dave Nicholson, Chief Research Officer at the Futurum Group, and I am joined by two distinguished individuals today. Mr. Seamus Jones, Director of Tech Marketing, Dell. Afternoon. This is where you live. Yep, this is our home. And Welcome. C <laughs> CEO of Scalers AI, Steen Graham. Good to see you, Steen. Great to see you, Dave, as well as always. You've put together some reference implementations, and we're going to talk about what that means specifically. But uh, I want to start out with you, Seamus. Sure. Why did you engage Scalers AI yeah. to do what we did here? Absolutely. We're going to get into the details, but what was, what was the thinking behind this? We started in on this journey, must have been two years ago, something like that. Well, the thought process for our team was that, look, we have the best of breed within the infrastructure, within the, the, the framework to be able to build out these machine learning and artificial intelligence uh, frameworks. Um, and we really wanted to find a partner who could understand the fast moving software stack and make sure that we can get the most out of the hardware and infrastructure that we were bringing to market. The thought process behind this whole uh, framework that we're putting together is the fact that, look, customers are being challenged every day uh, trying to implement, look, how do I make AI real, right? How do I make it real for my business? How do I make it a, a repeatable process that can be implemented uh, and make it a, a tangible uh, deployment? And uh, we wanted to try and establish uh, not just the fact that, look, you can do it and it's best of breed, but the fact that it's replicable, I'd say, uh, in a customer's environment by using GitHub code that we, we've posted out on uh, the Dell GitHub, uh, using white papers to try and articulate exactly what's, what's happening in the space. And really, we've done a lot of things that have been first in the market and, and best of breed. So t tell us about Scalers AI, first of all, just at a foundational level, what is Scalers AI all about? Yeah, Scalers AI was a, was a company that we founded to help fast track industry transformation with AI. And uh, you know, as kind of Seamus alluded to, one of the things that Dell has is incredible infrastructure across a diverse set of you know, requirements. And Dell's extremely motivated to move fast with their infrastructure and to lead the market in this innovation. And that's why we were thrilled to work with Dell and then you know, pairing that leading edge infrastructure with you know, the, the latest in innovations and in enterprise AI software is something we were really thrilled about. And so you know, driving industry transformations are our DNA and uh, doing that with you know, full stack solutions is something we're really proud of so we can make sure that they're repeatable for enterprises. We're talking about reference implementations across a variety of industry verticals. Uh, but we started out looking at inference and training in kind of a little bit of a different way. What's the main thing, if you had to sum up all of this together, uh, that we were trying to get across here? Yeah, I think if, if you look at kind of, you know, Dell leadership team said they really wanted to deploy, you know, AI solutions with companies' proprietary information, you know, at the edge and give them choice. The first thing we wanted to do is we wanted to show enterprises how they could take their proprietary data and be able to, to fine tune or train a model with their proprietary data, secure on-prem with leading power edge infrastructure. Building that fine tuning stack uh, across multiple GPU vendors on power edge hardware, pre-validating that solution, and then making that solution code available for anybody that wants to deploy power edge on-prem across GPU infrastructure. Really, you know, truly a pretty incredible stack that's available on the Dell GitHub today. And then on the inferencing side, you know, what, what enterprises want to do today is they want to be able to deploy inference affordably. And um, a lot of, there's a lot of misperception that you need the, the, best, infer, uh, the best GPUs in the market um, you know, to do just that. And I think there's a lot of workloads where you do really need the best GPU in the market, but most enterprises aren't running 24 seven, you know, simultaneous hundreds of thousands of users, right? And they've got, they've got cycles and downtime. And how do they take advantage of their existing power edge infrastructure and new power edge infrastructure they're going to get as well and be able to deploy inferencing across CPU that they already have deployments of mm -hmm. and GPUs. We're looking at the market space and it's changing. As more vendors enter into the market, we're going to partner with them. We're going to bring them into our portfolio of products. We validate them, certify them, and then, and then bring them out. The biggest thing is that wherever we're meeting customers wherever they are. So if they have uh, the largest of AI impl implementations, we can accommodate that right down to the mom and pop shops that have an edge implementation in a retail 
environment to determine inventory control or, or using uh, computer vision, you know, we can accommodate that as well. So you are able to take advantage of all the experience that we've put together on those large deployments, right? And then implement that experience, knowledge, expertise, and customer some smaller ones. We've done that in a framework called a Dell Validated Design. I think having limited supply of some of these component parts has caused customers to make unnatural choices in, their, in what they want to deploy within their environment. But having the choice of supply is going to mean that we can offer things that, uh, that no other vendor in the marketplace can. There's an emerging renaissance in getting hardware right that AI is driven. And I think, and then there's an emerging need for, for privacy and security of your proprietary data. Mm -hmm. And I think, you know, at least at you know, Scalar's AI, I think we're extremely well positioned to deliver customers across a portfolio of choice on their own on-premise infrastructure. There's a tremendous amount of opportunity and, you know, with the Dell validated designs, the Dell reference designs, the Dell GitHub repo with solution code, the work we do, there's affordable right. off-the-shelf solutions that they can drive their business transformation with. What would you say the most common misconceptions are when people think about AI from I, your perspective? While you can deploy AI on you know, standard systems that customers have today, having those high-end GPUs does make a difference. And having that performance capability does make a difference in customers' estates. The knock-on impact though that a lot of customers don't take into consideration is their power thresholds within their data center and infrastructure and the cooling requirements needed, right? Those are things that we have experience and expertise in and can help customers navigate through. This is why, you know, hardware is at the center of innovation again, and there's, there's this massive rena renaissance in hardware. I am so delighted by the fact that hardware <laughs> is cool again. <laughs> yeah. Steen, Seamus, thanks for joining me here from the Dell Experience Lounge. Doesn't look like we're in a, well, kind of like lounge bar stoolish. <laughs> thanks for joining us.